Black light and white gloves are tools that can be used for creative expression. With these two simple tools, you can use UV light and white gloves to create a variety of words and images to express meaning um, and to elaborate or to creatively highlight ideas in a song. In this tutorial, you are going to learn how to use black light and white gloves to effectively create words and shapes. When using black light and white gloves, first make sure that the gloves fully cover your hands and that there's no skin showing between the dark colored clothing, the black clothing on a day of performance and your gloves. Once there's um, once that's taken care of and there's fully um, gloves and sleeves and nothing else showing, we know that the UV will just capture the white gloves on your hands. When you first start out with using black light and um, black white black light and the white gloves, it is good to just try out making some basic shapes with the members of your group. Try making a triangle. Try making a square. Try making a circle first with you yourself and your hands. Now try with the part. Next, you want to try with a partner. Um, to create basic shapes like a square, triangle, etc. Once you have worked solo and with a partner on creating some basic shapes, you may want to work with a group of three or four people to try to create letters and basic three-letter words like sun, cat, run. When you've effectively created three letter words with your partner you can begin to move on to create other things such as four letter words basic pictures when you get into collaborating in larger groups of five and six people you can start to look at creating things like six letter words you can start to look at creating things like flowers or butterflies, what kinds of images can you come up with that you can create using your hands and the people in your group. Finally, I want you to take a moment to look at the clip, um, the YouTube clip that is posted on the website. I want you to take note of the techniques that are used in this short video clip. How did they use their hands to effectively create a variety of ship shapes? Were their hands flat? Did they use fisted hands? Were their hands curved? What techniques did you notice? I would like you to record on a piece of paper as many techniques as you can notice so that you can take that piece of paper into class and use those techniques as well you can use those notes to help you with your with your in-class test. That's it for this tutorial on how to use black lights to create words and images. Thanks for listening.